Australia has announced a plan to address its housing crisis, and it's by receiving a so-called new home bonus for Australian states and territories. The details with Sheena Selim. Experts warned that Australia is heading towards a severe housing crisis with a projected shortage of 107,000 homes by 2027. The government grapples to address the issue amid complaints from renters and charities who are experiencing the gravity of the situation firsthand. The government announced a four-year plan estimated to cost $329 million. The goal is to support up to 10,000 homeowners annually during the next four years. In a national cabinet meeting held on Wednesday, the state and territories agreed to pass legislation this year to implement the Helped to Buy scheme as part of an election promise during the 2022 federal campaign. Moreover, Australian Prime Minister Anthony Albanese emphasized the importance of passing the $10 billion Housing Australia Future Fund, which will build 30,000 new social and affordable housing properties in the next five years. This is a scheme that should have begun on July 1, and every day of delay is less social housing. The time for political games is over. Prime Minister Anthony Albanese also promised for states and territories to receive a new home bonus of up to $3 billion if they help reach an updated target of 1.2 million new homes over the next five years. A research paper published by the Parliamentary Library warned that Australia would need 671,000 public housing units by 2032. Meanwhile, the opposition argued that the government's five-year housing plan will only deliver just 3% of the social housing units needed for the next decade. Reporting from New South Wales, this is Shina Salim, SMLA News, Australia.